What's going on guys? It's Anthony, wrenched out, experiment. It's been a hot minute since we've caught up and uh, well, let's just get to it. Look into this. some cool stuff going on and I'm going to be making some changes so we will be producing regular content here at the Rensto Experiment. I've said that before this time uh, I'm gonna set things up quite a bit different now this morning I went out and did some photos with the Canon 80D this is one of my favorite all-time cameras uh, I use the GoPros often but nothing Nothing quite like this. Now, I also use my good old iPhone. This does an incredible job, the iPhone X, uh, as far as photos go, but still, I love using this. Now, one of the things was I haven't used this uh, regularly in a while. I have used the 50 mil for some shots, but while I was out this morning, I opted to use the 10 by 18 millimeter uh, lens and when I opened it this is what I saw so if you can see my lens did fall out my bag has been uh, sitting in here I've been taking gear in and out and fortunately for me I had my filter on because it saved the lens so there was no damage to the lens itself I shot several photos with this cleaned it up we were good to go but I did lose this filter it's okay I'm happy to lose this over losing the lens. Now this isn't a fancy uh, F-series lens or anything of that sort. I just hate losing equipment due to some dumb thing that I did. Now, jumping back to shooting new videos and more content and what have you, one of my personal issues has been my gear is scattered everywhere. Now I will be moving my office here in the next several weeks. And with that will come setting stuff up the way that I've wanted it set up to support video as opposed to trying to hunt stuff down and it takes me longer to try to set stuff up than it really should. So I'm super stoked to uh, be able to do that here relatively soon because just a quick, I've got gear over there, gear in the far corner. We've got gear over here. We've got a lot of gear up there. And I've got gear in my upstairs office and pretty much everywhere. Not great for a content creator where I wanna do things, but then it takes me 20 minutes, an hour to kind of pull everything together. And by then I'm already kind of moving on with my day. So I'm super stoked there. Also, I have uh, reignited the getting out every weekend with the kids uh work's been work's been heavy i'm still in college all of those things so i feel like i'm kind of getting a grasp on things and i want to dive back in because i've got some exciting things that i want to show you guys i want to talk to you guys about and uh that's really what the goal is going to be now with that being said i still have you know, a couple of weeks here where I've got to go through all my gear, I got to set up the new office and all of that. So what I'm going to attempt to do is probably not immediately after doing this video or even the next several days, but I will shoot some of the process of cleaning up the room as far as preparation for moving my office from the upstairs to the downstairs, which is uh, ultimately my old office or the upstairs office is going to become my son's bedroom. Right now we're kind of sharing it because he's only three. It's got a bunch of his toys, his clothes and his bed and then it's got my office in there as well. So he's gonna get the whole room. I'm gonna get a new, uh, one of the downstairs rooms 100% dedicated to my office. So super stoked there um, and I'm also stoked because I'll have a space. I've got some ideas for bringing some tables in so I can better explain and talk through an assortment of things to include uh, the audio video stuff that I like to talk about, the drones, 
Um, I'll also jump back into some firearm stuff and much, much more. So building that excitement back up. Um, and, and again, me leveraging the ease of use to be able to do videos is going to support that. Also, I've got a shitload of gear that I haven't been utilizing because it is kind of scattered and then I forgot where this and that and everything else uh, that I need to uh, put together in order to shoot some of the videos that I want to shoot as well. That's on me. I'm owning it. That's why I'm here. Um, as you can see, one of the big things that I have here at the Wrench Start Experiment is no adventure, no story. I've been getting out and adventuring with the kids uh, a lot lately, just going to different places and getting the Canon NED out, using my cell phone, using the GoPro, and it has triggered an incredible amount of creativity and ideas for future videos. So, I just got home a short time ago and thought, why not grab the GoPro Hero 8 and dive into this and uh, hopefully reignite, get that channel up and going um, and just keep moving from there. So thank you guys for tuning in. Everybody that's been supporting the Red Start Experiment, I definitely appreciate it. Thank you guys that have been hanging on. Um, I had plans on doing, hey, I'm taking a break because of life and because of COVID and because of work. And, and I didn't do it, um, not, not intentionally per se, but simply because I always had the intent of coming back and doing a video next week. Oh no, I'll just do it next week. I'll do it in a couple days. And it didn't happen. So I guess shame on me for attempting that. But uh, we're, we're coming back relatively well i shouldn't say relatively we're coming back i'm gonna make time i'm gonna create uh start creating some of the videos that i've always wanted to create and hopefully in the next couple of weeks i'll have the space to be able to do that both in there and then of course again organizing it to where it's a functional workspace as opposed to not and we're gonna dive into stuff like that as well so let's leave it at that guys thank you again for tuning in if you haven't subscribed hit the subscribe button share the video we'll talk to you guys later